now it's time to hook up this crazy concoction. It's pretty much uh, going from six to one. That's what I'm doing. Six wires into one wire. On this, and it's uh, 17 wires, so let's get going here. That up there, all nice, and get it out of the way. <coughs> now that the balance wires are all hooked up together, it has so these packs are just parallel right now. Before I hooked up the BMS boards, they were just two different separate packs. Now I hooked them up, so these six are all connected on the BMS side as well. Same with these six, but then through the balance wires, they are also in series now with each other. So this pack is already connected in series, and now I can check the volts coming out on these four lugs to figure out which of the which two of these four actually have my 65 volts that I need to connect to my other battery bank. Set this up. So the two center ones Oops. have 66 volts. Those are my two. And these two outer ones should be zero because these are the ones that are parallel together. So that I gotta put yeah, see these are zero. So I gotta put a jumper from here to here, and that'll be my main uh, my main jumper for um, putting these two separate packs in series so the current will flow through the jump the big jumper wire instead of the small uh, balance lead wires. And there's my jumper. Okay. So Forgot to hit the record button. Okay, so we got the BMS up. We're running my positive out to my bus bar. Probably in your way. You probably can't see anything. Let's see. Okay. There we go. Okay. Good old tripod. There we go. That's on. Now the only thing left is to hook up. Well, not the only thing left, but the only thing left for the BMS side of things is to hook up the negative. Now, let's get my multimeter out again. Double check. That side's negative, this side's positive, and let's see what it says. Correct? Correct. Okay. Negative. Okay, so we got extra wire here. So I'm wondering if we can put that there. I don't really want to cut it. Just in case I remove this again later. There we go. Now we need the main positive going to wherever the inverter was hooked up, and we're done. And wherever that cord went. I'll get back to you guys here. Ah, found it. Okay, so we got this side going on here. down to here right down here there's uh, a bolt one of these they can only hold two each all these uh, nuts and bolts so I got to find the 66 volt positive that I can put this on that has one bolt and that would be let's see I got a positive that would be this one here 
believe. I'm gonna double check that. It's pretty easy. All you have to do is put set your voltmeter meter. I got my one prong going from the battery pack that I just installed, and I'm just gonna test the voltage across. Nope, not that one. That one is uh, it's showing 66 volts, but this one is showing zero, almost zero. There's a tiny bit of difference between the voltages, but that's the one I want. So, this one here. So I'm going to put that over there so it doesn't hit anything. Take this off. And we're going to hook up the two systems. Actually, I'm going to pull this down for a second. I'm going to bend this. I'm going to get a better nut, actually. I don't like that nut. This one's a much better nut. This one doesn't have a shoulder. And the new nut does. Okay. Let's back up here. This with it. There we go. And that's that. Just gotta tidy up this wire, stick it up behind these, I'm thinking. It's gotta go up behind this one. over here so it looks a little neater yeah that helps a little bit all right so see if you guys were able to see any of that one second to get off the tripod all right so we are all hooked up now we got a nice long stretch of batteries up here shorter stretch here can't wait to get these up on the wall they're sitting right there but anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Again, I'll put these uh, BMS controllers in the description. They're the best that I've found yet. And they have lights that show that they're balancing. So at least you know what's going on. And this is, so far, the best Chinese inverter I've bought so far. It's been working amazing. And yeah. And then we got the Magna sign that I got from Battery Experts Pickering. This thing's amazing. Can't wait to hook it up. I'm just waiting on some large wires, which I'm gonna buy after I get the more solar, because yeah, I just I would rather have solar right now. Then I got these two charge controllers. I got the Morning Star down there, and I got those two tracers as well. And then I got another dist distribution panel that's going on the lithium side and then obviously this is for the, the main bank that's running off of gel batteries thanks for watching